So what's going on, guys? Where do I even start? So I saw, no, I actually got an email about these vans coming out. And the funny thing is I don't ever really get vans emails, but I think I probably got some some sneaker list somewhere and my information probably got sold to other companies. But I got an email from a store out of Canada. Um, trying to see the name of the store. Off the hook. Oh, you know what? That's what it was. I'm on the email list. I've been on the email list from a couple of years back. I just haven't got anything from them recently, or at least anything I pay attention to. But um, I was. Uh, it was a Saturday. Uh, I forget what was coming out. Whatever it was, I didn't. I didn't hit. Of course, I was upset. Looked at my emails, and I saw. I saw this email about a pair of sneakers, and I don't usually go for Vans. But I love Vans though because it's part of my childhood. I grew up in Southern California. And the reality, if you grew up in the hood and you didn't have a lot of money, Vans was always a safe bet, period. Nobody was going to make fun of you about your Vans. As a matter of fact, you could rock them to the point that they were shredded and come up falling apart. There was something so cool about it still because of the, of the skate culture. So Vans were always dope. Was, listen, Vans, if you're hearing this, you saved my life because as a kid, going through what you're going through as a kid when you're poor, and the fact that you know you can get a pair of shoes that people won't make fun of you on and, and and still feel good about yourself. I mean, let's be honest here. That's the truth. Some of you know I'm, exactly what I'm talking about, but enough about that. So I saw these, Anderson Pack. I'm a fan of his. Um, he's the, he has that like that that mid mid to late 90s, early 2000s neo soul going on. He's a singer, he's a rapper. And then even more, even better than that, that he has that old school fucking funkadelic James Brown vibe going as well. So um, I knew the shoes were going to be dope. I looked at the pictures and there was one that had the same pattern just like this. But there was another one that had this pattern, this pattern right here, which looked like a, like a zebra type, animalistic African type thing going on. So it caught my attention. So this is my first time actually looking at them. All I saw was the picture, small little picture, those on the, uh, those on on the email. I saw it's black and white, so I went for them. Let's see what they look like. This is my first time actually seeing these. I I, I, not, I haven't even opened the box. What the? Okay. Wait a minute. Vans got dust bags. This is the first time I've ever seen a pair of Vans. I've actually ever bought a pair of Vans that had a dust bag in there. See that pattern right there? I like it. This is very African, very zebra. You know, this is just dope. It's also like psychedelic from the 60s type thing without the coloring. But this right here, I really like. Okay, 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 I see. Pack, decide, let me put this as the, uh, as the base for this presentation. All right, so let's see what the shoes look like. Yo, come on now. For real? Wait a minute. I did not know that these were embroidered, like, kind of like. So this is like, this is like a sensory experience here. It's like this. What is this? Like the um, wool type, carpet type, not carpet, but you know what I'm talking about. It's, so it's, it's raised. It's sewn on top of the canvas. So the inside of it is that traditional, you know, Vans type canvas sneaker, but then all around it that the zebra pattern is raised. Wow. And of course, that suede toe tip, that toe box, the inside green, Addison pack. I love the bottom. You know the funny thing? I went to Inglewood High School and our color was white and green and black. So this is definitely rep repping for, for my, for my Alma mater, Inglewood High School, Inglewood, California. So this is this is crazy. This is really dope. This is really, 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 really a good looking shoe. Man. If I had any doubt about the, pot the potentials of rocking these, <laughs> these will be rocked. The question is just when and where. This, these are definitely shoes you put out because you want to make sure you get the right attention towards your feet so you can get that, you know, you can get that, that head nod. You know what I'm talking about? When you get that nod, you know, where people just say, yeah, I see you. 
this is this is a wonderful wonderful collaboration right here and the green laces too you know this is gonna look really good wow okay it's not what i expected but uh guys thank you so much for take, taking a little time out of your day you know have a great great thanksgiving um coming up be well be safe and just be grateful for uh, the little that you have or the big the, the the a lot that you have just be grateful and show it by show it by you know being kind to somebody else all right thank you so much i'm going to go ahead and head out